Can you give us an account of what happened in relation to the admission that you made about the lie? After I made the admission, um, there was, of course, discussion about my well-being, um, which I think rightly so because I had just shared a very deeply personal um, experience that I've had. Um, and the discussion that followed was that we would not pursue the matter further. Um, and like in my message, Mr. Singh used the words, take it to the grave. So the words, take it to the grave, came from Mr. Singh? Yes. Are you very clear about that? Is that your recollection? Yes, I'm very clear. All right. And that's the language that you use in the message that you sent to Mr. Nathan and Ms. Lowe at 12.41 p.m.? Yes. Right. It is not a phrase that I would usually use, so All it right. did not come from me. All right. Did he say this in the presence of Ms. Lim and Mr. Faisal? Yes, he did. He did. I understand. Thank you. The impression that uh, I got, at least, from the testimonies of both, in fact, all three, Mr. Faisal, Ms. Lim and Mr. Singh, was that you were very emotionally affected and unable to have a conversation on this issue. Again, can you give us your account of that? If I was not able to have a discussion on this issue, then why would I have been left on my own to make a decision as they have claimed, which is not what happened? They, right. I mean, yes. And to use mental illness as a way to discredit someone, I think, is extremely out of line.